a very special episode of Miss Hall of Exercises. This is our Sweat in Small Spaces series. This is a small space, but we're gonna sweat in it. This is a Hall of Family tradition. On the weekend, we like to see how many sit-ups we can do, how many push-ups we can do. That's what we do for fun, and you're gonna join in the fun. So, you don't have to sweat by yourself. Get your brothers, your sisters, your grandparents, your guardians, your moms, your dads, whoever lives at home with you, Get them to join in the fun and see who can last the longest. This is our Sweat and Small Faces series. So, you're gonna want a towel for all the sweat. You're gonna want a water bottle so your body can make more sweat. So, here's how it's gonna go. We've got 10 exercises. Each of them is one minute on the clock. 10 exercises times one minute each. This will be a 10 minute sweat fest. We're gonna start with our wide run. Ready? We got a minute on the clock. Here we go. Do what I do. This is a wide run. This is what football players do to warm up. You might see them with tires all along the field, and they've got to run in the middle of the tires. This is a great warm up. All right. Next. Good job, everyone. Woo! Gotta love it. Swing your arms, involve those arms. I like to clench my fists. You could have open, open hands if you want. All right, 20 seconds left. You're doing awesome. Nice. Remember, deep breathing. Get your lungs with lots of oxygen. You should feel the blood starting to really pump. Awesome, we're almost there. Two and one. Nice job, everyone. Next, we got push-ups. So you can either do them with your hands like this and your feet out, not touching any other part of your body on the ground, or you can do a modified push-up with your knees on the ground, which is what I'm gonna do. If you have a mat, you can even roll it like this to give your knees more cushioning. Ready? We got a minute on the clock and Go. Nice. Woo. Oh yeah. This is the good stuff. Whew. Nice. Nice job, everyone. Woo. All right. We've already done 20 seconds. Just 40 more seconds to go. Yeah, feels good. Awesome. Really try to touch your chin to the ground. Oh, I think I spit a little bit, that's okay. This is sweat in small spaces. Things get a little moist in here. Oh, feels good. Oh, I'm not giving up. Nope. How are you doing at home? Yeah! Keep up with us, you're doing great. Awesome. Eight seconds left. Nice. Almost done. All right, make it count, make it count. Yeah! And done! Woo! Put your mat back. That was awesome. Well done, everybody. Next, we've got our sit-ups. You just sit like this, okay? And really make sure your feet stay on the ground for this. What you might want to do, too, is hook your feet underneath, like the couch or the coffee table to keep your feet uh, stuck on the ground. Or, you can see how you do without any kind of anchoring. But we're gonna start the clock. Ready? One minute. Here we go. Sit-ups. Nice. Awesome. I like to put my hands up near my head, but my hands are not pulling on my head. They're just resting there. Like I'm tickling my ears. Yeah, well done, everybody. Stay with us. Breathe in when you go down and out when you come up. Awesome. Nice work. I bet we're all making some pretty funny faces. Doing this exercise, but that's okay. I'm really starting to sweat. It is slow feet. This is great. Yeah. Okay, 10 seconds left. You're doing fantastic. Nice work. Keep going. Keep going. On the center. Five, four, three, two, one. Well 
Well done, everyone. Okay, next, we've got the cheese. Now, I'm gonna show you on the side so you can see. The cheese will look like this, okay? And your feet are just touching the ground. So like this. Because we're in a small space, I can't really show you exactly how it looks this way, but I'm going this way. But you'll figure it out, because you're smart. Ready? We're gonna put a minute on the clock for the cheese and do what I do. Ready? And here we go. Five, four, three, two, one. Cheese. And I like to switch to the other side for my other cheek. Yeah, feels good. Awesome. Don't let that hip touch the ground. The only thing touching the ground should be your feet and your hands. All right, excellent job, everyone. Keep that hip up in the air. Right. T for top. But you're doing great. So I'd say it's key for terrific. Oh yeah, feel the burn. Whew. Feels good. Yeah, keep going. Stay with us. Stay with us. Awesome. Whew. Nice work. Oh, I really feel that in my hips. Keep those hips in the air. Remember your breathing. Nice. Three, two, one. Keep for time. Okay, next, we got burpees. I don't know why they call them that, but I'm just gonna show you how we do them. We start standing up, and it starts with a jump, and then you foil yourself on the ground, like this, okay? And then up again, jump, and foil yourself on the ground, okay? You can do any kind of version of that, whatever, Works for you, whatever's comfortable for you, but I'm done talking. Let's put a minute on that clock. Here we go. Five, four, three, two, one. Burpees. Woo! Burpees. Feel good. Yeah. Oh. Awesome. Keep going. You're doing great. Oh, nice. We're almost halfway through. Woo! Oh boy. Really, really starting to feel that burn. Oh. Woo! Stay with us. 20 more seconds. Oh, oh yeah. Woo! Oh. I'm feeling it now. Feels good. Oh yeah, Woo! Oh. Woo! Oh. Oh. Okay, keep going. Five, four, three, two, one. Well done, everyone. Time for a dab off. Oh, nice. And a bit of a water break. Make sure you get your water in. You need to take a break. Take. Okay. All right, folks at home. This is marvelous. I know I'm feeling great. I hope you're feeling great. Clearly, I'm getting to like the orange zone here where I'm having a hard time talking. It's a good sign that I'm working my body hard and I love it. Next up, we got leg raises. So, I'm gonna show you how your leg is gonna look just from this angle. They're just gonna be just off the ground like this and then back down. But in the meantime, your body's gonna be laying on the ground like this. Okay, so this is how it's gonna look. Leg raises up, leg raises down. The rest of your core in your head is planted on the ground. So, if you need someone to help you by holding down your shoulders, you can try that. But if you think you can do it by yourself, let's go. A minute on the clock. Five, four, three, two, one. And leg raises. Woo! Oh yeah. The legs just go up and down. It's a very, very small distance. Nice job, everyone. You really should feel that in your core. Oh yeah, you can even put your hand on your core. Feel that burn. Awesome. Nice job, everyone. Is my face getting all red and sweaty? Because that's how I like it. Well done, everyone. Working hard. I know you can do it. I know you can do it. Stay with us. We got 10 seconds left. Stay with us. Awesome. We're almost there, everybody. Three, two, one. Try to sneak in the next one before the timer runs out. Awesome. 
Awesome. Okay, we're gonna feel that tomorrow and the next day. Next, we've got mountain climbers. So, our hands are planted on the ground. It's gonna look like a push-up, but our feet are climbing up a mountain underneath. Ready? Okay, let's put a minute on the clock. Five, four, three, two, one. Mountain climber. Oh yeah. Keep that hip kinda down. The legs are busy. I know that not a lot of us can get out to climb up a real mountain because of what's going on right now. So, we're gonna climb up a mountain in our small space. Whew. Oh yeah, I'm feeling that. Awesome. Whew. Nice job, everyone. I bet you can move a lot faster than this hollow. I bet you can go as fast as this. Whew. All right, feels good. Okay, nice. Oh man, how are we doing? Are we almost 50 seconds? Okay, yeah. Woo, mountain climbing. Feeling it, feeling good. Keep breathing. All right, four, three, two, one. Oh boy. Oh, that feels awesome. Okay, wow, I'm really a fountain of sweat now. That's awesome, that's what you want. Okay, we got three exercises left. You guys are doing so well. Now we're gonna get on to planks. I'm just gonna fix my headband, of course. Very important uh, part of the whole outfit. Planks, maybe you've heard of them. It looks easy, but it's actually kind of tough because all you do is put your hands on the ground and the rest of your body in the air, except for your feet. And you gotta keep your back nice and straight. Okay, your hips should be pointed to the ground. So we're gonna start the clock. Here we go. One minute, let's go. <sighs> nice job, everyone. <sighs> to make the, pass, the time pass, we can think of what we might look like right now. Like maybe a dock on the edge of a lake or a pier on the edge of a sea. Or maybe we look like um, the road or a bridge. Pause in 30 seconds. You can even try bringing your elbows down for fun. Cause that's, that's fun too. Oh, feels burn. Feels good. You bring your hands back up if you want to. Oh boy. Oh boy. This is a, uh, this is tough, this is tough. I'm not gonna lie. Yes, I can do it. I believe in myself. Three, two, one. Oh boy. Oh yeah. Oh, this is great. See what I mean? You can sweat anywhere. My goodness, I mean, this can't be more than Two and a half feet across, three feet across, and I'm working up a real sweat, and I bet you are too, that's awesome. Okay, two things left. We're gonna end off with some super fun stuff. We're gonna end off with two exercises left. We got jumps, and then we got the swimmer. So, jumps can be anything, as long as it's jump. Let's put a minute on the clock, okay? As long as you're jumping in one space, your feet are lifting the ground. Five, four, three, two, one. Jumps. Oh yeah! Oh. Jump, jump around! Yeah! Just like a bunny! Just like a magic jumping bean! Woo! Just like oil droplets on a hot pan! Jump around! You can pretend that the ground is volcano, lava, and you can't touch it! Get off the ground in one! Feels good! Three seconds left! Stay with us. Oh boy. Oh yeah. You would turn it into a one footed jump, a hop. Nice job, everyone. Feeling good. 
kind of joking, but not really. We're gonna do swimmers. This is our last exercise. And if you stuck this way, stuck with us this far, you would have seen this hollow kick is a pretty interesting faces. And uh, I'm so glad you stuck with us because this was so much fun. Okay, I'm gonna need a nap after this, I think. All right, swimmers, belly on the ground. Both arms in the air, both feet in the air. And you're gonna be flailing about like this, like you're a swimmer, okay? Some people call this the Superman. I call this the swimmer. While you're doing it, you can decide what you wanna call it. I'm done talking. Three, two, one. Oh, it feels good to be in the lake. After all, that's wet. <clears throat> Woo. Oh yeah. No part of your body should be touching the ground except your core and your hips. Feet are nice and nice and straight. I mean, uh, legs are nice and straight, of course. Cool, that's what is getting to my brain. And your arms are out in front of you, just like you're swimming in the Olympics, in an Olympic pool. All right, that's, uh, that's another place you can sweat, is in a pool. You don't feel it as much because you're surrounded by water. But this is a good time. We're having a good time. We've got seven seconds left of our workout. I'm so proud of all of you guys. I wish I could see you right now, but instead we're doing the next best thing, which is sweating together. You did it. You gotta be proud of yourself. All right, just sit with me. Just take a few deep breaths. Right, we gotta cool down. Get your towel. Oh, I'm nice. I feel good. Get some water. I can't wait to see what my hair looks like after this. I bet it looks funny, right? Does it look funny? Excellent work, everyone. I hope you really enjoyed the Sweat and Small Spaces exercise as much as I did. And I'll see you next time on another episode of Miss Hollow Exercises. <laughs>